Hi everyone, this is Kay from AdMain and I thought I was going to give you one of those uh, old-fashioned from Goodwill to eBay um, sales videos. Um, so I did not do any eBay all summer long and way into the fall because I was busy with my Airbnb. I did just recently get back into it and everything so I figured I should just do these videos. This is some of the things that sold on one of my eBay accounts and uh, I figured I'll just let you know. Most of the things here actually came from Goodwill and I think most of them came from Goodwill by the pound. So let me get into it. Uh, this one uh, did not get come from uh, American Goodwill. Um, I think this one I picked up when I was in Norway at the one of the thrift stores there they had little uh, glass cage with a lot of stuff i remember picking through something so this would have been the equivalent of a dollar and uh, it's really pretty uh this uh, brooch thing in pewter pewter is uh seems to be certain kind of pewter is very popular uh over here scandinavian pewter norwegian pewter i have sold quite a bit of it and this one was quite nice so yeah, that was good. I, and I got, I think this one sold for 40, I think I took the best offer of $40 on this one, but very cool. Um, next one, <laughs> more pewter, uh, three of them. And I actually got this here. As far as I remember, I think I got this at my local Goodwill here. It's been a little bit of a while. Also, these are all old listings. These were the old listings I had before I even went off the summer. <laughs> so I just reactivated my store and here they are. But um, anyway, these one, three, very small. They were like little coasters size here. So you can see how small they were, but uh, they sold for $28.95. And I think, I believe they went to Japan. So that was pretty cool. Uh, this one came from Goodwill by the Pound, I believe. <laughs> um, I found a lot of, I'm, I'm surprised what the great quality of clothing you can get there. It's, of course, it's a whole bunch of junk, but then you have some really nice high-end type um, items that uh, go there as well. And uh, I took a best offer on this one as well. And I think that was $35. This was a nice cashmere um, sweater, very soft. I was tempted to keep it myself, except the color just did not <laughs> did not do anything for me. So actually, that was uh, that was a good thing. But uh, yeah, this Rafi cashmere, I looked it up. They have some beautiful things online and very expensive. So Goodwill by the pound probably paid 50 cents for this because it was very lightweight. It was very thin, but beautiful. Oh, the next one, uh, this was a heavy wool coat, uh, kind of a, it's, it's, I would say it was vintage um, and um, it was made in America. It went to Denmark and this was the label on it here, Forecaster of Boston. Um, I had this up all last year and no bites there, but then um, somebody in Denmark um, I recently bought it and I sent it over there with a global shipping program. So that was good. It was a nice coat. Bibles, it seemed to always sell some Bibles and um, I get a lot of my Bibles for free now. But anyway, this one sold. This is one of the ones with, you know, with a giant print. So that's always nice. $25, medium mail. I did a video of these and I got a couple of these. Um, as you see here, two available, one sold. And they were too long for the table that I wanted to use them for. Um, they're these long runners, but they're actually quite long, so uh, I decided that I was going to uh, sell them on eBay. I have one that I'm keeping um, for myself, but they, they, they are uh, long and uh, I had planned to keep them on a couple of different tables but and, and sort of like a window thing, but it didn't really work. So I put it on eBay and they sold for 30 bucks, which is not a great return, but it's better than returning it um, to target which you can't do anymore anyway <laughs> it was limited but anyway i have a few watchers here i see for the remaining okay just a very simple old navy uh fleece uh, vest so nothing about it i just said that it was logo free <laughs> but um anyway another goodwill by the pound thing so easy and quick to ship Another Goodwill by the Pound. Uh, these are those Wallabies, uh, original ones. These are, I mean, th this is China made, but they're still cool and vintage looking. And these were corduroy. So I thought that was uh, a nice uh, thing too. So yeah, they're, they're kind of cool. <laughs> also yarn. I pick up some yarn and this is not even wool yarn. I, I tend to want to pick up the nice wool yarns out there, but this one was totally synthetic. It was from England though. And I took a best offer of $24 for this one. Just sold this one. This was a North Face um, and it was a rayon polyester type shirt. So um, 
also from Goodwill by the Pound. It was a large and um, I took a best offer on this one for, <laughs> I should have looked this up, but I think it was this one that Noah took offer for and I think it was $25. So yeah, that was, that was good. Very lightweight as well. <laughs> Another Goodwill by the Pound thing. There's some people up there that exclusively pick up toy pieces and Legos and uh, all kinds of, I'm not, I don't know a lot of the toy pieces, but I had seen some of these before, these little Shopkin crates, and I have some other ones too, and I figured, ah, oh, well, um, they don't weigh anything, so why don't I pick up some? And anyway, somebody bought them for $15, cost nothing to ship, basically, they're super light. Another one from Goodwill by the Pound, this is Victoria's Secret, very pretty night shirt gown type thing so uh, it was in a large i took a best offer of 30 on this one um so yeah that was very nice it looked almost new actually so that was always good when you sell 90 um garments all right um this little wind chime thing these were pewter um hummingbirds um yeah very 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 quaint little thing here I, I didn't have such good pictures on these ones but um anyway <laughs> they sold uh, eventually and i think they put a full price on this one so um yeah and i remember putting them in a little uh, priority mail so that was also a very lightweight little thing it was a li i had to untangle it a little bit i remember but otherwise it was okay oh and this one um I have, I think I showed this in one of my haul videos as well, way back in the day, but this is one of the, it's from Canada. And the reason I show it, I sold it and I broke it when I went to get it. So it was kind of a bummer. I have seen this uh, again though. So um, this series here uh, is something that will sell. So I just kind of show it because once in a while stuff happens, but it did sell and it did break. So, ugh. This one did not break and I just sold this one. Um, I love my Norwegian elk hound mug. Terrible picture here. I was trying to take pictures in the dark probably. This is, they look really bad. But um, anyway, certain breeds, uh, eventually they will sell. And this one actually had a little flaw in it. It had a little glaze bump thing on the back. But anyway, <laughs> can't complain for 20 bucks. And now it's nice. Most mugs, they go first class. So you don't pay a lot to ship them. Another Goodwill by the pound. These are Birkenstocks. I tend to pick up any kind of Birkenstock no matter what shape, unless the cork is totally disintegrated. But um, anyway, took a best offer of $25 on these. And uh, they were they actually went first class. They were very, very lightweight because they didn't have a lot to them. They were just um, <laughs> little thin straps. I've talked about this before, foreign DVDs. These are some of my kids' um, old DVDs. You just have to make sure that you um, specify that they are region two if they, you know, they're from Europe or say region three. I've never ever had a problem. And the one who bought this one bought the next one too. So that was two DVDs for 30 bucks. Um, Brandman Sam, the fireman Sam, I think he is also here. And Postman Pat, he's a British uh, <laughs> little puppet thing. and. Uh, yeah, anyway, two of those uh, went out for $30. So that was nice. Another Goodwill by the Pound. These are these um, uh, wool hats now. This is the season, of course. Uh, quick uh, to grab, quick to ship, nothing to store, $15. It's okay. And finally, for now, a little bit of picture here. I'd also show this in a haul video. They don't make these anymore, so people will eventually look for replacements. And uh, yeah, that was a that was a nice sale, <laughs> right right there. So yeah, very quaint. Didn't take too long, but I do remember showing this off in a in a haul video. So that is what I've sold so far. After getting back in the game, I am now back to try to list a whole bunch of new things. <laughs> um, I, don't, um, I, I definitely need to do that again. And I will make more of these videos. So let me know how things are going for you sales wise. And especially now before Christmas, I am sure uh, things are going to get hectic and busy for all of us, which is great. All right. I'll talk to you soon. Bye from Kay in Mad Maine. Bye.